On October 24th was the 78th anniversary of the UN creation. I received a six-week warning to prepare for a December war in the U.S. Tomorrow is December 4th and it's six weeks. And it is also the 78th anniversary of when the U.S. joined the U.N. In the Lord's eyes, the war coming to America is the responsibility of the U.N. and the U.S.A., despite how it will look. On December 1st, the Lord shared his heart about a particular person that I think is Biden, and this is what he said. All across the land, there are plans brewing by those brooding, and in those plans, I am waiting and watching for them to turn around. Will they notice me there in the room, or will they never look up and notice me there? What are you doing, I say in their ear. Hello, can you hear me? I'm right over here. You're pacing, look worried. What's that gleam in your eye? Are you enjoying the calamity as I ask you why? Who do you bow to when at the edge of your seat? Your appearance so polished, but nothing is neat. Your crumbled up ideas are littering the streets, just kicking the can of your duties, all incomplete. Look, your carriage awaits you, your guards lining up, but you stumble before honor, just ignore that defeat. I warned you and called you, even gave you that dream, but you never thought twice, thinking it's not what it seemed. And now you're delivered into hands you don't know, pretending you know how to run the whole show. A director, a producer, I'll wait for your green light go. But I say stop, tell them forget it, and that you don't know. What's even worse than you driving a stake in the ground? It's deciding the country you loved now must be drowned. Where have you fallen asleep at the wheel? I remember you once had a heart full of national zeal. That was our deal, back when you could feel, and you had your hands on the wheel, O oh man of steel. How far you have fallen. Just last night I reminded you how you once said a prayer every night before you went to bed. And that time I had warned you, and you knew it was me, but you shrugged it off, and the warning, but now it shall be. So be it, saith the Lord.